I gotta make this quickly, because I don't know how long my battery lasts, but breaking news, everybody. Hurricane Rick, look at its sustained winds. 180 miles per hour. Saffir Simpson, Category 5. This is a very serious hurricane. Um, this is one of the strongest hurricanes in the Pacific Ocean that has occurred in a very long time. Hurricane Rick is uh, stronger in the winds of Hurricane Katrina. This is a very serious situation. Rick was not forecast to be this strong at all. I thought it was going to peak at minimal Category 5. It is a really powerful. In fact, it's almost as strong as Hurricane Wilma of the Atlantic Ocean in 2005. This is a very bad hurricane, and it is supposed to make landfall right in Baja, California. And as you can see, look at that. It will go all the way to Texas. This is a depression. Rick was not forecast to be this strong until today. Look at the maximum wind speed probability. By 11 a.m., it was supposed to be 175 miles per hour. However, it's stronger than that. It's supposed to be a Category 5 all day today and remain Category 4 through Monday. And it will looks like it's going to rapidly weaken. It, it's, it is going to rapidly weaken. Hit Baja, California as a Category 1 or 2. And then it's going to rapidly weaken, go into... Texas as a depression or a remnant low. Um, so, Baja Californians, anybody who lives in Cabo San Lucas, anywhere like that, you need to watch out for Hurricane Rick. Rick is a very serious hurricane. This is highly unusual for a hurricane to be that strong. I was surprised at how strong it was this morning. I knew it was a Category 5, but I did not know it was this strong. So, watch out for Hurricane Rick. And it's very odd that this strong of a hurricane is forming in October. Mid-October, and it's this strong. It, it has topped all hurricanes that's occurred this year. So...